Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today we are building a home for the tragic clown. And just in two days, I think you will see me build his family. So I didn't do like a whole like, I guess, makeover for the tragic clown just because like it's already like a generated sim. Um, so I just tried to make them or him from scratch. And I gave him a child and a toddler just because this house is three bedrooms two bathrooms so i thought oh he can have a child and a toddler and i did use the new kits in here um obviously this is not really a serious build so i probably should use the kits in a more serious way but i don't know i think it fits i think it's fine i think the tragic clown paints in his free time maybe he makes a bunch of sad paintings who knows um but yeah i really wish you could like choose more than three traits and create a sim because in that video i wanted to make him like a goofball a loner and socially awkward but then i was like oh he should be gloomy as well but i there's no fourth trait slot so hopefully he can earn that on his own somehow and yeah um i went for very bright and beautiful colors and i will say i'm not really proud of the toddler's room just because like i feel like with the new kit the colors are like very goth or very pastel so it's not really those bright colors i did choose like beige and white i guess there's like a pastel yellow and blue color that i could have used but i just i don't know it didn't look good together with like the wallpaper and the flooring and everything i tried to do so i don't really i'm not really proud of the kids room it could or the toddler's room it could probably be a little bit better if i just used the base game stuff because i feel like it's out of place because that furniture is very very expensive basically is giving fancy vibes and i did try to make a fancy house but like that is so out of my comfort zone and i did do a build like that but i just wasn't happy with it because i thought it looked bad because i don't really build fancy homes so i don't think i'm good at them um i just prefer to stick to my style because again i felt like i don't know it, it felt weird i didn't like what i did so i scrapped it um but hopefully you like the outside i do stick to the outside for a little bit longer than usually i feel like i usually just jump into the inside because i'm so excited but I do stick to the outside for a good bit. I'm just getting some beautiful flower boxes. And yeah, I pretty much use all of the colors in the rainbow for this build, which is lovely. And yeah, I gave him like a small, tiny little car. Um, that was nice. I did use a garage door. We don't have a garage door in the game, but I use like the snowy escape door. And it's four tiles wide, so I did have to make the bump out. A little bit longer or bigger I guess or wider I guess since yeah we're going on with here but yeah it's a pretty simple build I like it I think it's nice and hopefully soon I will do an actual build with the kids I'm not really sure because again like I don't want to stress myself out about like building with the um, nursery kit just because again it's giving fancy and I don't think I'm good at doing fancy homes so I'll try all his hemmed but I'm not sure how it will go but I think I'm gonna leave the voice over here I'm very sorry um it's I just have nothing to say um it's pretty simple and hopefully you like the sims that I made for this build um I didn't give him a partner I guess that would have been fun if I did but I don't know I I just don't think the tragic clown has a partner unfortunately and i did make him a him but i i think it would be nice to make a female tragic clown a non-binary tragic clown i think that would be nice um but yeah um anyways i'm so sorry i don't know how to say bye like i feel weird leaving from a voiceover to like to music but it is what it is. I will see you at the end to give you guys a tour, but hopefully you enjoy the music going forward. See you soon.
So here is our clowntastic home. My terrain paint did delete, so please ignore that. It's already on the gallery, so you won't have to worry about the terrain paint being gone when you download it. If you download it, if. I don't think anyone will download this. But in the front, we just have two chairs. We have a nice little drink tray for his guest. If, or maybe he doesn't have any guests because he's the tragic clown, but maybe he's trying to lure people to be his friend. Um, There's a mailbox. Don't know if that's functional, but it's fine. And he also has like a very tiny little car. But once you walk in, you come into a very colorful build. So you walk right into the living room space. You have chess. You have a place to put down your keys, your coat, your shoes. And yeah, this is the couch. Love it. This is his desk area. And then you have like a little dining room and a little paint area. And as you can tell, he accidentally messed up his wood floors. He is very unlucky. But in this first room, it is his bedroom. I very much like it. He has like a very sad cloud decal and a broken mirror. Pretty sad. And then this is his ensuite bathroom. Pretty nice. And then this is just like the downstairs bathrooms for the kids. And we have our nice little small kitchen space. We have our condiments, our fruits, our flowers, and our utensils. But once we go upstairs, we just have a crafts table for the kids. We have bun bun, a thermostat, and a height chart. So this first room is for a child. They have a nice little bookshelf, a bed, the science table, hopefully it doesn't catch on fire, and they're in scouts, which is pretty nice. And they have a desk area with a journal, they can collect marbles, they have their book bag, everything they need. And then this is the toddler's bedroom. So I, I like it. I don't know if I like it honestly. I just feel like it's out of place. Like maybe it's just because it's not as colorful as the other rooms. And then on the balcony we have a games table and a place for the kids to like come and watch TV. I don't know why this is moved over. And then to the side area we have a telescope, a picnic table, and a grill. And the trash can is just in the back. But if you do for whatever reason want to download this house, um, my gallery ID is just Sims Delicious. And I did not limit my pack, unfortunately. So, I mean, if you want to make the best clown house, you kind of have to use what works. But I'm going to end the video off here. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it. I really loved making this home. And if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. I love you. You are important. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.